today's topic is going to be exact differential equation so what is an exact differential equation if m dx plus n dy is equal to 0 is the given equation then where m and n are functions of x and y or they may be constants also in that case if this condition is satisfied which condition dou m by dou y is equal to dou n by dou x if this condition is satisfied then the given differential equation is said to be an exact differential equation okay now let us see how this differential equation is to be solved so the solution of the differential equation is given like this solution integration m dx where we will be treating y as a constant plus integration terms in n free from free from x dy is equal to c so first of all we will integrate m dx where we will treat y as a constant then we are going to integrate the terms in n free from x dy is equal to c so let us see one supporting example to see how the solution of the exact differential equation so this is the example that we are going to solve x square minus a y dx is equal to ax minus y square dy so first of all what we will do is we will write this equation in the standard form of m dx plus n dy so i will write this like this x square minus a y dx plus we are shifting these terms to the left hand side so this minus y square will become plus y square and plus ax will become minus ax dy is equal to 0. So now in this equation we are going to have m as x square minus ay and n is going to be y square minus ax. So now we will see whether the condition of exactness is being satisfied. So differentiating partially m with respect to y. So he, uh, here we are going to treat x as a constant. So derivative of x square will be 0. And derivative of minus a y with respect to y will be minus a. Next we will find dou n by dou x since we are differentiating n partially with respect to x so y will be treated as a constant so we are differentiating minus ax with respect to x and its derivative is minus a so the condition is satisfied so dou m by dou y is equal to dou n by dou x and now we are going to see the solution by making use of the formula that was discussed earlier which is integration m dx plus integration of the terms in n free from x dy is equal to c okay let us continue now so first of all we have to see the integration of integration of m dx so m in this case is x square minus a y dx plus integration of the terms in n free from x so the terms in n free from x now n is y square minus a x so which term is free from x this term that is y square 
so we are going to integrate only y square with respect to with respect to y so over here plus integration y square dy is equal to c okay now we will do the integration this implies so we here we are treating y as a constant so x cube by 3 that is the integration of x square minus integration of a y with respect to x is minus a x y now integration of y square with respect to y will be y cube divided by 3 is equal to c so this is the solution of the exact differential equation which we had set up earlier if you want you can also do one more step in this one more step what you can do is take all the constant terms to the right hand side so remove this denominator by doing the cross multiplication so this will be x cube minus 3 a x y right plus y cube is equal to now 3 gets multiplied over here so you can just write this as c itself or you can introduce one new constant and call it as c dash but otherwise keeping this as c is also fine because eventually it is a constant that we are talking about so for our final answer we can just write it as final answer x cube minus 3 a x y plus y cube is equal to c that is the solution of the exact differential equation which was given earlier i hope you were able to understand what is an exact differential equation solution of the exact differential equation and how to solve the exact differential equation. Thank you.